Afghanistan today is a very different country from the one that existed only five years ago. Since then, the government of Afghanistan has made a full skills effort to invest in rural communities and begin the arduous task of rebuilding collapsed systems and institutions. Today, Afghanistan is on the threshold of a new beginning on the path towards growth and development. The National Solidarity Program, building on success. The National Solidarity Program, NSP in short, is the government's flagship community empowerment development program. It is one of the most effective vehicles throughout which the human, social, economic dimensions of poverty are being addressed in rural Afghanistan. NSP is building on a national network of self-governing communities across the country, communities who have the freedom to choose their representatives and freedom to choose how best to deal with their collective needs. When the program was launched in 2003, President Karzai showed his full support. The Mili Paywastun program then put all Hiwatki Pailish. The Afghanistan Pahar Kaliki, the Fakar, or the Biosuyu Khatma, or the Kulio Biaragawana, the Dovlat Asli Wazifat. The Mili Paywastun program, the Amalikulu Lapara, the Kaliwalu Jurgo Takal, Zeruri. So the Hiwa, the Kulio, the Biaragawani Chari, the Kulio, the Musharanu, of Simoizu Jurgo, Pomashwara. Since the program started five years ago, over 20,500 communities have elected their Community Development Councils, or CDCs. Today, there are elected councils functioning in 346 districts across every province of the country. CDCs were formally recognized in November 2006 through the passage of the CDC bylaw by the President of Afghanistan. برنامه همبستگی میلی میگه از نامش پیداست که یک برنامه مردمی است ای به مردم تعلق داره خودش از نامش پیداست که موسیقی همبستگی یعنی وحدت و نظر مردم است که مردم بتانه با تمام مشکلات فایقه از نگاه مادی و از نگاه مانوی از نگاه مادی ما توانستیم که سرک خداباد کنیم که شما شاید از ایدیوال هستی از نگاه مانوی میتونیم ما منازعات داخل قریه ای که باشه او را از این طریق حل بسازیم دیگه خدا ما امی نظر ماست که امی پروسه بتونه ادامه پیدا کنه Every community is entitled to up to 60,000 US dollars as a block grant which can be used only for projects that have been prioritized in community development plans and benefit the entire community CDCs are trained in managing these funds and members of the community are kept fully informed on how the money is being spent CDCs are one of the most cost-effective service providers in rural Afghanistan today. All communities must contribute at least 10% of the cost of their projects themselves. This ensures accountability, transparency, as well as ownership and sustainability of the CDC projects. Development plans mirror the priorities of the rural communities. NSP priority projects are focused on educating youth by fixing schools or building new ones and by building and rehabilitating infrastructure. NSP projects have given 7.6 million people in rural Afghanistan access to safe drinking water and sanitation. 4.4 million people now have access to electricity, many for the first time in history. NSP has increased the yield of cereals and vegetables for over 851,600 farming families through small-scale irrigation projects and NSP has provided 13,270 kilometers of rural roads to the more than 25% of villages which don't have year-round road access. NSP is not just a development program. Through the promotion of participatory governance, NSP is shaping communities based on security, justice, transparency, unity and solidarity. NSP is helping to restore the social fabric that was ripped apart through years of war and strife. It nurtures new ways of decision-making for communities. NSP's goal is to attempt to cover 100% of all rural communities in Afghanistan. 
it still needs to facilitate the election of many new CDCs in remaining districts of the country. To do this, NSP will require continued support from donors, the government of Afghanistan and the Afghan people. What has been accomplished over the last five years through NSP is just the beginning of a journey towards economic growth and poverty reduction. The government is committed to taking this journey with its people. NSP has been designed for just this purpose, to give the poor a head start in their struggle to overcome poverty and become prosperous. The National Solidarity Programme is building on success and giving the Afghan people hope for the future.